Okay, so I'm somewhat disrobed here. That's because we're talking Ink Masters and one of the stars of that Spike show here with us now. Aaron is. Thank you very much for being here. Well, thank and you. while we're doing this interview, I want you to I want you to ink a tattoo on my arm here. <laughs> so that's what we're gonna do. So start um, here. First of all, congratulations for being on the show. Thank you very much. When you got the word, were you just like kind of taken aback going, wow, this is gonna be a whole new audience for me? Absolutely. I I I've always wanted to do something of this stature, something of this level for years. And then when I got the call, I didn't expect it because I didn't think it would actually really happen. Now, you can't tell us anything about the show in that you can't say, uh, this person won, that happened. Well, Unless nobody won yet. It's a live finale. Oh, really? So it's... Can it's... you let us in on anything? Can we get you in trouble at all? Uh... <laughs> no? Okay. It... How, how, I, I have to ask you this, though. How was the experience, or how has the experience Amazing. Been? It was like boot camp for a tattoo artist, honestly. Now, at the same time, while you guys are going through this and while you're doing this, it's a competition, but do you think you've built some strong friendships here? Absolutely. Absolutely. There was a lot of bonds made and broken, and broken bonds mended, and a lot of things that happened there that... I mean, everyone's going to have to see throughout the course of this, the, the actual the season to, to, to understand, but it starts off as a rival's season, but it doesn't stay that way okay, keep for drinking. most people. Keep sorry, drinking. sorry, sorry. So with that, though, is it an experience that you are so glad that you did that you took absolutely, part in? Absolutely, absolutely. It's one of those things that, like, in the beginning, you're unsure of doing and taking yeah. part in something like that, but um, now that I've done it and I've been there, I, I couldn't appreciate it or, or have loved it more, like, because it's made me a better artist in person. Well, long I was long. gonna ask you that. Have you, did it give you any other ideas as an artist? When you're looking at other people's works, it's gotta help you grow as an artist. Absolutely, I, and I look at my own work differently now, which is, it, I think, the biggest benefit, because I think I've learned so much about myself as an artist and a person because of what we went through. Because as an artist, no one actually tells you straight to your face, that's a terrible tattoo. Yeah. They just like on social media, and yeah. that's all you hear. So no one, no one actually is literal about their critique. How did you get started with this, just out of curiosity? I met a guy that tattooed, and he saw a drawing portfolio from high school, and he literally said, you should be a tattoo artist. And I said, okay, and then I, that's when I started. No, I noticed you're covered with tattoos. Any of them on yourself that you did yourself? A few. <laughs> Seriously? Isn't yeah. that a bad idea? I, yeah. <laughs> but as a, learn, as a learning artist, it gives you a better understanding of what you're doing to somebody else, okay. and you can kind of, it kind of blends what you're doing with what you're getting, so you become a better artist, I think, in the long okay, run. Okay, tell, tell us when and where the show is. Oh, it's uh, every Tuesday night, 10 o'clock, on Spike TV. Aaron, awesome meeting you. <laughs> We're going to finish this in the break. Ashley, this is, this is it, the work, a work in progress right now. I can't wait to see the final oh, masterpiece. Yeah.